One. And Terry's lifting off, going across the night sky, disappearing through some clouds quickly and coming quickly back into view. The first stage looking nominal or normal so far, lighting up the night sky there above Virginia, orbital ATK's and Terry's on its way. You can see its flight path in the lower right corner. Again, it flies in the southeasterly trajectory away from Virginia, out over the Atlantic Ocean. Operation at 55 percent. It's passing 15,000 feet per second. TVC is slewing for main engine shutdown. And we're going to be standing by for MECO, or main engine cutoff, for the first stage. Core pressures remain nominal with VNO4 and VNO5 open. And we have MECO. And MECO, or that main engine cutoff, is confirmed. Storm. The first stage, the fuel gone, it's job done, dropping away. And Ceres is in a brief coast phase now while we wait for the uh, right conditions. As Matt described, now we're in a bit of a coast stage here. ACS is enabled. Yeah, a short coast phase here, and the uh, next event will be the fairing separation. Uh, we had nominal stage one burnout velocity, it's just over 17,300 feet per second. We have fairing separation and interstage separation. All right, well, the fairing and the interstage dropping away, Cygnus in the second stage now exposed. We have T plus 260. TV and we have stage two ignition. And a good confirmation, the engine on stage two, it's a solid rocket motor, now ignited. And it's gonna to continue to boost Cygnus into orbit. Stage two uh, ramping up to full pressure. The Castor 30 motor will burn for uh, approximately 150 seconds. 